Hey guys, welcome to my channel and today I'm trying something different today because why not? So anyways, um, as you can see, I am dressed as Kiki today which I will have a little flex even though it's just a dress but it's something a bit nice I want to try something new so might as well give it a shot so basically every video that I want to make will have a different cosplay so this is my cosplay for today yeah so let's get on to the video anyways guys today I'm gonna try out some guess what poppin cooking yay this is a looks like a little high tea set dessert set which looks pretty interesting I've never tried this actually I've only tried the burger one once and uh, another ice cream set so I, I don't remember it's been ages ago but anyways I mean it looks fun might as well try give it a shot yeah and if you stay and finish this video which I'll be really happy I'll be opening a subscription box which I just purchase a six month subscription about it. Give me a moment. The Yumi Twins um, subscription box which is great. So if you guys finish this video then you get to see this. So anyways let's get things started right now. Alrighty guys so I have set up everything which is on the floor and on carpet it's okay there's a mat here so let's get started. As you can see, this is the cook pop and cooking box. I'll quickly just get a little skim for you guys to see. Um, <laughs> hopefully nothing screws up. Uh, by the way, you need water, so I have water here. And a microwave, I'm gonna open it. Um, what's it called? I'm using my other, which is my phone, to record this, so bear with me and I just yeah I realize I forgot scissors I'm crying so I'll be cutting this let's go So anyways, as you can see, there is a plate, or well, a plastic plate, but it is what it is. And like cute little instructions of what you can make, which is really cute, oh my god. Okay, so as you see, I will start spreading this out. Oh, we have, we have a cookie. I will just move everything so it's less OCD. I'll quickly spread everything out so it looks neat. Okay, so as you can see, you can get the mold and all the little um, plates to mix everything in, if it makes sense, you know. And I'm assuming, yeah, we have to cut this out. We've got we've got a purple packet and a red packet, which is I'm assuming it's strawberry and um, blueberry, and we got. We got a jelly mixture and orange mixture and I'm assuming a green jelly mixture for it which is nice. So, so as you can see there is a mold which is really cute like it has all the little blueberries and strawberry and orange and mold it's so cute oh my god and we have um, the icing and we got um, the cake batter which is cute. So, we got a spoon, a little cute pink spoon for mixing and everything. I see. So this was kind of like when I opened, like when I opened the package, it, the, the biscuits just came like this. Okay. Anyways, we got two biscuits, which is nice, and I, I want to eat them, but I can't. <laughs> and we got a piping bag, as you can see, a little cute piping bag. So I'm gonna get started. Hope I don't mess up. Alright, time to cut this out. 
Oh uh, yeah, so basically um, most popping cookings, since I've done the cheeseburger one, you have to cut like the plastic where it tells us to cut, as you can see. I am cutting that right now. Anyway, let's continue. So we got a little scoop thing, it's for the water, which it will instruct you right here. If you're wondering um, how many scoops they are, it's, for example, that's two scoops, that's two scoops, that's one, and yeah, I think it's pretty straightforward, honestly. Two scoops of water. So, grab our scoop, where is the jelly? We'll move everything to the side. Oh, except this. And we'll start making the jelly. Actually, let, let me smell it <laughs> for a sec. Ooh, it smells like melon. Ooh, actually not bad. <laughs> I'm gonna just quickly pour this and see how it goes. Alright, as it is. Up. And... That's two. Two. Very nice. Time to stop mixing. I don't know when to stop mixing. <laughs> it's just non-stop mixing. So while the jelly is solidifying, we're going to the next one, which is step three. The other jellies. Okay, let's go. So actually it's time for the, what's it called, the icing, which you need piping bag, which is very nice, and both of these, well, this one will go in the microwave apparently, so hopefully nothing goes wrong, if it does I'll be very sad, so let's go, let's add the batter. Icing's done. As you can see, it's just clear white. Actually, let me have a little taste of it. It's just creamy. Creamy and sugary, like everything else. And we're gonna put this in the piping. Let's give it a shot. Ah, my god. Okay, we got the icing in the pipe, the piping bag, okay, that's good, what's next? Alrighty guys, lastly, the batter, and that is two scoops of water, as you can see. Okay, so got the batters in. So you see, probably just tap it a bit, like I'm actually baking, but I'm not. And yeah, all right, time to chuck it in the microwave, and I'll be right right back. Oh look, guys, I am back, and I have quickly microwaved this for 20 seconds because my microwave is really strong, and it started puffing out really like crazy. Like, it puffed up, like, up there and I had to stop before, like, something disastrous would happen. But yeah, here are they. They are pretty hot right now, so... Well, since everything's done, the, everything's solidified, as you can... I don't want to tip it over, but yeah. Everything's solidified, and let's get decorating. Not bad, not bad. You can't 
can't even see anything, but it's okay. Apparently there's a top. Well, this is kind of a lonely high tea, but we got a cake. Yay. Oops, put this to the side. Yeah. Okay. Since we have these biscuits, let's just make two of them. Another one. So apparently this one you add icing on top. If I have enough icing, then it's a miracle. It's, the colour's getting a bit dull, we need to spice things up by making another biscuit. Another biscuit cookie. Alright, everything is finished and here is my presentation. You know, Every, every chef will be so proud of me. Look at that. Look at that. That's, that's just amazing. Why am I shaking? Ah! It's okay. Anyways, before I destroy everything, let's just try this one. Oh. Cheers, I guess. It's... hope nothing goes wrong. bad taste of the orange texture I mean it kind of tastes like cake but not much flavor yeah let's try this biscuit and biscuit tastes really good but with everything it's actually pretty good I mean it's just sweets I'm eating sweets right now we'll take a bite of this one which is creation, which is cute. It's pretty close. Tastes like the, the orange one, or a strawberry. And I guess since the other one is the same thing, we'll, we'll try the jelly one. This is like a, oh my God, it's breaking apart when I try to pick it up. This is the jelly one. strong melon. So overall, I can say this is actually not bad. I mean, you guys should try it. If you can find it at a local or maybe some Japanese online store because I bought this at my local like area and they, they had it. They had other kits too. So that is the video for today and actually no. We have um, an unboxing to do next, and you, if you guys made it at the end, thank you, and hopefully you enjoyed the unboxing, which is going right now. Well, the hello there, I am back, and today, as you can see, we're opening the Yumi's 2021 subscription box, which is the January theme. As you can see, the theme of this month is New Year's Home Party 2021. Oh my god, from opening this box, I can already see a plushie, which is so adorable. Oh my god. But the first thing that slipped out of the box was an information booklet, which explains everything, what you get inside, and the little details. Which is absolutely adorable, as you can see I'm flipping through because it's really cute, and you don't know why I'm focused, but yeah. Well, there is a page where it explains what you get inside, which is really helpful for me. So, anyways, well, the first thing I see is actually really adorable. It's a tiny Shiva chopstick rest, which is so cute. Oh my god. So I can see that there is a theme of food and celebrations. So here is a closer look of the little Shiva. Well, the next thing I was super excited about was actually a Studio Ghibli theme, which matches my cosplay. I am so excited. And it's a Ghibli No Face chopstick. As you can see, it has details of No Face on top of the chopsticks. And yeah, it's plastic, which is good because I can use it for my rice for dinner time. 
All right, next up in this subscription box is a Shiba bowl. Look at it, oh my God, it's so cute. It's so small. Perfect for my rice and whatever snacks I need to put in. There's like little details on it and it's plastic. So it definitely matches with my chopsticks and my Shiba holder. So next up that I see in the list is a Shiba serving tray. Look, look at the cute details. It's plastic, but it has that texture on the surface, which is perfect for my bowl and everything else. Well, here is me putting everything together and voila! Oh, there. <laughs> well, well, it's okay. Okay, up next is a Daruma plushie magnet, which as you can see, I got a little Shiba and Shibas are my favorite doggies. Well, since my scissors are a magnet, I can demonstrate on my scissors that is a magnet. Woo. And lastly, I saved the best for last, which is the adorable Yumi Twins exclusive Pom Pom Purun New Year's plushie. So here's a Pom Pom Purun opened, which you can see it's obviously official because everything has to be official in the box. It's actually super soft, this plushie, and it's holding a fan. Oh my god, I, I just want to squish it all day. Well, since I just started purchasing the subscription box, I got a bonus for this month's theme, which is adorable. This is exclusive to the Pokemon Center, and since it's the year of the ox, we have a Pokemon which is a Tyrus and a little Pikachu in it. So here's the box and the details, which I am showing you right now. And so it gives you a little written Japanese, which is cute. I I don't understand Japanese, but if you guys can translate, that would be great. And it gives you a little stand. Here is a ceramic figure. It's so cute. And here is the base for the figure. It's so cute. And oh, here's me realizing what the gold backdrop is for and there you have it wow okay so that is all that is the yumi 2021 january box and if you want to see more then we'll see you in the next video bye